Welcome to this video guys. In this video we are going to update this scotch yoke link mechanism in SOLIDWORKS from this to this, right? And our ultimate goal is to make the scotch yoke mechanism like this one. So let's begin guys. This is our linkage with the wheel. So right click on this link and select this first option guys to open it in a separate part file because this is assembly file and then just select this face click on sketch and then select a center rectangle from center point to this point make a horizontal straight line and on the other side as well length doesn't matter guys just make these lines make sure these are straight and a vertical as well to mirror entities i will explain these as the tutorial proceed further now select a line and make these lines inclined straight inclined and close the sketch this is turned into a gray one it, it shows that the sketch is closed and now press control button select these two points select this line and make relation symmetric guys see the sketch this is symmetric and now press control button select these two points and this line and make relation symmetric you have to press the control button con constantly guys and then uh, now select the smart dimensioning tool and here the angle is 150 automatically this angle would be 150 because this is symmetric so keep it or delete it doesn't matter but one angle should be 150 so select this bigger line now and specify the dimension of it 30 millimeter is fine now uh, select these two lines and the distance between them is three millimeter guys and now the sketch is fully defined now i want to just mirror entities to the other face so select this mirror entities and here is the work of the center vertical line in this window i will select all of these four lines and mirror about window here this one so this is the role of that vertical line guys check this box now and now go to features extruded boss base by default it is extruded in this direction but i want in the other direction guys this direction since i want it i want to extrude it up to surface so select up to surface and select this surface we don't need to bother how much we need to extrude just select up to surface and click the other surface now select this surface guys click on sketch because we are going to make a circle here so select a circle and make a circle at this very center point now press control button guys select this circle select this line make relation tangent we don't need to define any dimension guys this is fully defined because we have already added a relation so now extrude this circle i want to extrude it in blind so select blind up to 150 millimeter 150 check this box and now i want this extrusion on the other side what i will do i will mirror i need a plane for this and this plane that is right in between these so what i will do i will click on the mirror where is the mirror this one mirror in this window i need to select a plane so as i explain this vertical plane and in features to mirror definitely i will select this line let me show you full preview and here we go this right here is going to be mirrored so i have updated this guys so you need to press ctrl s button or save it from here now cross it and our linkage mechanism has been updated so in the next video uh, we will be making a vertical support so see you in the next video guys